coverage you can count on continues with Storm Team 10 meteorologist Everett Lau. Good Saturday morning. We're starting off the weekend on a soggy note. A look at the Storm Team 10 clouds and radar shows rain showers lifting up through the Wabash Valley. Now you'll notice the back edge is starting to make its way through Illinois, so we're only going to keep rain in the forecast for the next couple hours, and then it will start to move out. Now, fortunately, we're going to be holding on to that cloud cover as we go through the afternoon. So we're tracking the morning rain showers. Temperatures are going to be holding pretty steady, pretty close to where they are right now, unless you're down to the south, where they'll cool off a little bit more. And it's going to become a breezy afternoon. Not terrible right now, but the wind will be picking up as low pressure system pulls off to the east. So look, the Storm Team 10 storm tracker locally this morning shows most of the rain showers now confined south of Interstate 70. Though we still have some rain showers up here to the north, just to the west of Paris, moving into the city there. Down here around the Kansas and Grandview area. Still seeing some rain showers in Terre Haute and up into Park County, just to the north of Rockville. Seeing some steady rain showers also over into Putnam County. Then down here further to the southwest, we're seeing steady rain showers this morning down in Clay, Jasper, Crawford, Richland and Lawrence County, everyone's seen those steadier rain showers. And then further to the east, seeing some pockets of more moderate rainfall over here across Knox County around Vincennes and then just to the south of Linton, and especially over around Bloomington this morning. So if you're doing anything early, you want to have that rain gear handy, grab the umbrellas and the jackets as you head out this morning because the rain showers will continue. Temperature wise, right now this morning, We've dipped down into the upper 30s for Mattoon, Paris, and Effingham, all at 38 degrees. It's 42 right now in Terre Haute, 47 in Sullivan. But notice Washington and Ligoti still in the 50s, but that colder air is going to be working in. But then temperatures will be holding pretty close to 40 over the course of the day. So look at the wind speed right now. Again, some places seeing a calm wind, like Terre Haute and Brazil, Robinson not picking up anything. But Flora, 16 miles per hour, 10 in Mattoon. There's a low pressure system right over central Indiana. And as it pulls off to the east, the wind speed is going to be picking up behind it. We could see wind gusts today as high as 25 miles per hour. So a day planner over the course of your Saturday is going to show the rain showers continuing to move out. So by the time we get towards lunchtime, I think most of us will be done. Holding on to the cloud cover, though, and notice temperatures right around 40 degrees, maybe 41, and then we'll drop back down into the 30s as we go into the evening hours. So out of the weekend, if you're wanting to do something outside, see some drier times, Sunday is definitely going to be your pick. We're expecting a mostly sunny day tomorrow. High is just a little bit cooler, but again, for today, rain showers in the morning, but we will dry out as we go into the afternoon. Here's a look at future cast. You can see that activity pulling off to the east, so by the time we get towards lunchtime, Maybe just a few isolated showers out here into the eastern portions of the News 10 viewing area. But for the rest of us, holding on to the cloud cover as we go into the afternoon with that northwest breeze. Again, gusting as high as 25 miles per hour. Then for tonight, the sky is going to try to gradually clear out a little bit. Here's 9 o'clock. You see a few breaks in the clouds. And that clearing really takes place as we get into tomorrow morning. Still hanging on to a few clouds, especially tomorrow morning. But we are expecting more in the way of sunshine. And then by the time we get to tomorrow afternoon, the sky will really clear out. We'll get some sunshine, but it will be a seasonably chilly day. So for today, 41 degrees, but it's pretty close to where we are now. So temperatures holding steady over the course of the afternoon. Again, wind gusts could be as high as 25 miles per hour, so it'll be a little chilly as we get into the afternoon. Then for tonight, the sky gradually clears. Lows will drop down into the middle 20s. Still could have wind gusts as high as 20 miles per hour, but the wind will calm down as we get into tomorrow. 39 degrees for the high under that mostly sunny sky. North wind at only 5 to 7 miles per hour. And as we look the next seven days, Plenty of sunshine in the seven-day forecast. Temperatures holding fairly seasonable. Then as we get towards next Friday, Christmas Eve, we're holding on to a slight chance of some rain showers. So unfortunately, right Christmas, not looking too likely.